Hello, friends and foes, fays and fiends. Welcome back to Quests and Chaos. We are in the middle of a combat. Ooh. So last week, our uh, very impressive heist team stole a painting so quickly that um, we had to make up an entirely third episode for them. Uh, but it's okay because they accidentally let slip who they stole the painting for. And so now the thieves guild that had already stolen the painting is attempting to steal it back. There's a lot of theft happening in this module. Um, so come in and join us. We are technically playing through Keys from the Golden Vault, but just know that this is a very strong departure from anything you'll find in the book. Although I did go through and find some stat blocks that I hadn't gotten to use yet because my team is too efficient. Um, and now you're getting to see them in their full glory with some additional bonuses because I need this fight to like feel meaningful. Um, but oh my gosh, we are starting off our return with a blast from the past. The Apollyon just dropped us a thousand bits. Thank you so much. I miss you. Someday we'll do our Frostmaiden reunion and save Stuart from himself or uh, will we? Donovan. Donovan. Donovan, that's it. I was yeah. like, wait a minute. Wrong. All of my characters seem to be very similar. That's weird. You know, <laughs> was it? I mean, Donovan was also basically a wizard rogue, so yeah. Yeah. I understandable. Anyway, thank you so much. Uh, we'll go ahead and give these bits to I want play. to catch you one. Need, you need, you need, need to Yeah. Redemption. You want to catch another one? Yeah. Catch two. Catch two. Yeah. Ha -ha! Well done. Well yep. done. <laughs> we should do the card thing now that we have more. Yes, oh, yeah. Do you want to buy a card right now one. before yeah. we are at the top one. of the initiative okay. order? All right. The lair action is do you want to buy a card? two of you. Yes. We don't need to hoard all the bits. So one of these, uh, one, yeah. A laundry <laughs> of As long as I'm that one. <laughs> all right. And you should definitely go watch our Rhyme of the Frost Maiden campaign. Yeah. A lot of fun. It's, it's wild. It's a good time. OK. It's so fun, though. And deadly. A or B? Mm, I'm feeling B. B? B. B. Yeah. B. B. Sure. <laughs> Dramatic. <laughs> Splat. Oh, greater swiftness. When consumed, your speed is doubled and your AC is increased by two for ten minutes. That is great. You can have that because you're the only one. Oh, you have a card too, but you don't have a card. I don't have a card, but no, take she it. used her card. I don't want yeah. that. Use the card. Yeah. You <laughs> I want the short rest. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I want the one that gets me attack more. Gives me back my spells. All right. Um, so, we are currently, uh, how's more laid out? Uh, we have a very injured assassin over here who is uh, smirking in an unsettling way uh, in your general direction. We have this dwarf over here who so far has not attacked anyone. He has been shot in the shoulder once, who is just, you know, very like, I don't, I don't know, I'm like, look, maybe we talk about this. This all seems very violent. I was just looking for assistance. And then we have this mysterious uh, grunting somebody who has appeared on top of this tower behind Gemma and just knocked Priscilla off the tower with a glaive strike. Um, which brings us back to the top of the order. I have to roll a thing, as is oh, tradition. Okay. Wow. Uh, just Stop really, bringing in more people. We're just really having a time here. Why, why are there more? <laughs> why do that? To what end? I mean... There's no guarantee they're gonna show up, or they might be on your side. You are waiting for a ride, after all. That oh my god! Uh, we are. We, we've been waiting for a ride for so long. And that he I comes forgot. in in a fire. <laughs> that could be he handy. Literally, we've been um, waiting for a ride for like thirty seconds. <laughs> <laughs> a really long time. You were in the courtyard for like an hour and a half. Okay. Yeah, yeah, an hour. You had to hear Ocean's uh, deeply mundane backstory. Yeah, <laughs> it was glorious. Yes. We it was loved entirely, it. It was entirely just a setup for a bad joke, like. Yeah. And it took Stuart like 45 minutes to come up with that joke. Okay, so, so you, you it was, really. It was a while. It was worth so it. So you, <laughs> yeah. you, you spent, the, you took the time, and we respect that. Stuart just literally like running over ideas in his head for how to how to get the line out, not mm -hmm. quite being true. Yep. Um, well, you're gonna have to think faster than that. It is your turn. Uh, I'm going to slowly move my way towards the rest of the group, 30 feet. Just kind of keep out, moving out there. in the open. Okay. Cool. You want to just be there? Yep. Yeah. Burger. What could possibly go wrong? And then I'm going to dance on my feet and take the dodge action. Okay. Valid. Um, 
it is Dusk's turn. Uh, she is going to reach into uh, like the little like hip pouch that she's got going on. She kind of looks at you guys. Uh, she's gonna pull out a syringe, cinch up one of her bracers, and just go <laughs> shunk, and shoot herself up with something. Okay. Oh, uh, Stuart also is like, oh no, th- th- <laughs> that person is a, is a druid who's wild shaped into a human. <laughs> and that's all he says. Um, <laughs> uh, Gemma, up on the tower from behind you, you just hear like, hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Keep that in. No, wait, hold on. Keep that up. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, uh, that's her. That's gonna be her whole action. <laughs> that means it's important if that's her whole thing. Uh, um, and then, uh, let's see, it's our dwarf's turn. Let me go look at my notes for Buddy over here. Can tear free action go, what's your name? Yeah. Give me an NPC name. Herbert. <laughs> my Herbert. I had his card ready. I was just waiting because I knew it was coming, y'all. I've learned how this works. Time stop. What's your name? What's your name? What's your name? If one We're you... civilized around here. We can do introductions. <laughs> Everyone, what is your name? What are your pronouns? <laughs> Anything Sir else Hubert. we need to... Uh, no, can you say that again? I want to make sure I'm pronouncing it correctly. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Can I Thank add you. you on Facebook later? Uh, I do not have Facebook, but if anybody still uses G+, we have hacked version <laughs> from back in day, right? Yeah, uh, no, you look me up. Herbert Frost... Like, I, it's all those... With the, Frost... No, 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 you know all the Norse letters. It's yeah. like runes. You have to switch to runic keyboard. Oh. I know, it's like, it doesn't... It's much prettier in the original language. Hard to translate into common. Yeah. Can we pause for a second and have you install that on my phone real fast? Uh, you're very far away and my legs are very short, so if you want to come meet me in the middle, happy to help you with that. No. I am I don't very wanna... slow is thing. No. Okay. After. <laughs> Later. Got it. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> help me focus. He's in help me stay. Ocean? <laughs> Move yeah. just like, right. Like, again, I get legs very short. I am trying my best here. I mean, I guess, I, you know, honestly, at this point, uh, maybe I maybe I take a uh, dash action and try to get a little closer because this is feeling very uh, unproductive to be so far away. Hello, friends. I am Herbert. Nice to meet you. Um, <laughs> Ocean, that's going to be Hello. your turn. <laughs> Ooh, okay. So I am now very close to a bunch of people that I don't want to hurt, a medium distance from a guy who might want to add me on Google+, and not too close to the lady who's trying to hurt all of us. And just shut up. Yeah. Yeah, I'm really afraid of that, actually. (laughs) Um, I don't know why you're so worried. Her eyes are just glowing like a tiny little bit. It's fine. I... I'm gonna do the wither and bloom thing again. I'm gonna pop out just far enough that I can get within range to cast and plan to duck right back around. Mm-hmm. And um, I'm casting that this time at third level. Okay. Um, so once again, that's going to be a um, con 15. Extremely passes. Okay, so then um, you are still um, actually, She's hang banged. on. I did. Yep, I just rolled a bane. That's why I'm double checking. Fifteen, you said. Yeah. Still passes. Okay, so <laughs> just then... by a much smaller margin. Okay, now. so when you cast. Uh... Okay, so I need to because I'm casting it at a higher level. I need to roll three d six. So bring in all your d six, and it's going to be half the damage. Gold. Cool. All right. Okay, that's seven. So three and a half. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Not the best. I rolled a five. Um, and and then is anyone in, no one's really in range who needs uh, to regain uh, hit dice. <laughs> <clears throat> Nobody's really in range who needs to regain hit dice, right? I'm at full. I'm so, four under full. I'm okay. Okay, yeah. I think everybody's. Yeah, and, and you're all kind of iffy on the radius anyway. Don't worry, I'll go back. Okay. Yeah, I don't think any of them are in the yeah. same radius. Yeah. So I thank you. Much. Fortunately, everybody seems to be doing okay for the time being. Um, until the drugs take effect. 
had a thought and I'm, oh, uh, am I out of actions or can I squeeze in one quick cantrip? Uh, this is just, I don't know the rules. No, I don't remember. You can use action. a bonus, if you have a cantrip that is a bonus action, you can use it because casting Wither and Bloom was okay, your Okay, how can I tell? It'll say BA next to it for bonus action or there should be a little, in your spellcasting tab. Okay, yes, I do have. I do have a uh, one BA for blade uh, for blade ward. So yeah, if you want to, I want to do that. Yeah, you can blade ward yourself, so that if you get stabbed, you will get less yep, stabbed. That is the thought. Good plan. Thank There's you. a lot of stabbing happening. There tonight. is a lot of stabbing, and I would like to be less stabbed. Thank you. Yeah, I support that decision. Thanks. Cool. Um, I think that is going to then bring us to Ocean. That was Ocean. No, sorry, Gemma. I'm sorry. I was looking at the thing and said the wrong name. Uncut Gemma. <laughs> that wasn't. It funny. took so long. Mm -hmm. um, oh, <laughs> are we finally? Are we? Are we finally <laughs> yeah. understanding that we have multiple pun names here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Multiple pun names here. Um, okay, so what I would like to do is just like give dude peace sign. Uh, run to the other corner. Mm -hmm. Jump. And misty step to that tree. Ooh. Okay, so you're gonna like leap off and then poof up here. Yeah. Okay. I just, Easy. Cool. I, it's seven squares away, and I needed to be six. Oh, times I got gotcha. you. I got gotcha. you. Uh, and then I'm going to Eldridge Blast. <laughs> God damn. That's that what I do. Was I cool. I don't think that's going to hit her. Or this. Yeah. Do the okay, bits. We'll do a bit. Okay, that's gonna be, I think, 14 to hit? 14 will... Nice. She didn't set it yet. We have another bit. I was gonna say, it's 14 with the bit? Mm -hmm. Okay, it will miss. Aww. Aww. She's got better than leather. Or has better dex she, than She I has do. drugs. She's no. dexterous. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I, She's yeah. metamorphosizing. Better, better. Clearly, what clearly what better makes you dex. assume it's drugs? She used her whole turn to shoot us. There were lots of things that you utilize intravenously. She was just feeling kind of. I got a hydrate. Yeah. <laughs> Look, you don't you don't know her life. Maybe she just fights better when she's hydrated. When she's high. Hydrated. Or maybe she uh, wants to seem a lot more edge lord and puts her healing potions into a syringe. <laughs> Reflavor stuff to confuse your players. Pro tip. Um, that is so funny. Uh, anyway. I hope that's what you did because I'm impressed. Um, this guy up here on the top. I'm sorry, I'm jumping between all of my stat blocks. What do you get to do? What do you get to? Not glaive attack me. Because <laughs> I'm on a tree. In a tree, on a tree. Are these like trees that branch up, or are these all like decapitated trees? Um, they are decapitated for the purposes of being able to see the battle map. They are just like scraggly okay. winter time. So she's trees. like, in a tree. yeah, she's you're not, like, up she's in not the on top of a very tall stump. No, you, okay. yeah, you are up amid the branches. It looks much cooler. It's so cool. Imagination. Um, I'm trying to double check. Um, this creature is going to um, uh, climb down the tower. Start making your way over. <clears throat> um, let's see. How good is your athletics? I think you can probably continue. Yeah, you've got really good athletics. You can move and then also probably get all the way up to here. He seems to just be he, like like this is very just like this is just like a very casual like climbs down moves his way around seems not particularly bothered by anything just just making his way. Sorry. Um. um Shared I, experiences. I should be tracking. Uh, uh Tear, that's gonna be your life. turn. <laughs> Okay. So, I was a little bit distracted. So he just like crawled down the building. He climbed down the back of the building and just came around the side. Seems very unbothered. How does Dusk look? Better than she did previously, but still pretty messed up. You son of a bitch. 
Okay. Tyr's gonna look at her and do like a and then she's gonna attack the, the guy that just crawled down. Okay. She's gonna sneak attack him. Okay. You gonna rapier that? Is, because Priscilla's within five feet, right? Oh yeah, he's right behind her. Yeah, 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 cool. I wanna rapier attack, please. Mm -hmm. Get to 10. Definitely not gonna hit. Got him. Uh, this guy seems like he is wearing uh, much better armor and also armor that is actually designed to cover the sensitive bits. Cool, cool, cool. It's a, I'm gonna... It's a man. Yeah, it's, it's less aesthetic <laughs> than uh, Dusk's. It is a lot more, like, functional. If I want to take my greater swiftness, is that an action or a bonus action? Uh, consumed, speed is doubled, AC is increased by two. If it does not say on the card, I will allow same rules that I allow for any other potion, so I'll allow you to do it as a bonus action. Can I drink it, please? Yeah. Or do you want to hang on to that so you have the effect? Oh, I know. Okay, yeah. Thank you, though. I'm going to fancy footwork away. No, oper no I'm not. No, I'm You're not, because I didn't hit my attack. I'm going to stay there. Okay. But my AC is better. Cool. That's my turn. Um, you do not have to track rounds because that's my rule. I don't track rounds unless it's my effect. So you now have to track rounds. You get uh, you get ten minutes. So hope this fight doesn't go for another sixteen hours. Um, <laughs> probably won't matter, but just in case. Ten, mi ten minutes. That's what it said. Well, when I originally said this, I thought it said ten rounds. I was going to say start tracking rounds yeah. just in case. No, apparently it's ten minutes. You have sixty rounds. So you might not actually need to track. Well, I'm going to track it, but. <laughs> You and give me a job and I'm a note taker. I will. It's important do to it. be it's to, to have documentation. The focus. Yeah, and the yeah. documentation. All right, I got it. Um, so that's tier tier's turn. Okay, that is okay. Um, and that is going to be Priscilla. <laughs> but what happened? I'm so curious. Remember to ask Cheryl later about how Alondra likes to just ro like roll dice as a fidget Sometimes. just to mess with yeah. people? Mm -hmm. <laughs> or it's something happening on another plane. We're never <laughs> gonna know. Yeah. I definitely, like, on Chaos Agents, when the characters start getting into their hours-long conversations, that's table time. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> <laughs> I will, stuff will be happening as they're doing mm -hmm. that. And be like, oh, oh yeah, you talked for a while? Oh, that guy over there died. <laughs> You're bad. Intimidation tactic. Unfortunately, that's on you. Yeah. Um, Priscilla has a lot of cool things that she can normally do, but she is incredibly screwed up right now. So she's just gonna go with uh, like a pretty basic uh, sling her bow on her back, fling out her dagger, and is gonna try to stab this guy real quick. You got it. I mean, I think you guys have it more than uh, she does. Uh, she absolutely uh, cannot break through his armor with that roll. It was a good try. Roll better! You have such high stats. You're so high level. <laughs> Disadvantages. You you have killing it. You have cards. You can. Use I'm them not going to use them <laughs> on the allied NPC unless but it would help if, us. If three of you are down, then I will burn cards on your ally NPC because you guys are the heroes of this story. I just happen to be here. Um. It was worth a shot. It was worth a shot. And that brings us around to the top of the round. Uh, that is going to be Stuart, and I have to make my top of the round rolls. OK, great. I hate the rolls. Um, I would like to. Calming. Uh, that would be using my action. Calm. Stuart is going to walk pimpishly up to <laughs> Dusk. He's gonna swagger up to Dusk. And going, he is going to try, wow, this is terrible. Make the move like I'm going to kiss her and then grapple Just her. Just kissing. Everybody wants to make out with my NPCs. It's <laughs> but great. But not making Standing. out, just faking just out. Faking out. <laughs> oh, Don't yeah. worry, if this doesn't work, I'll do it. So I'll this is a grapple team. attack? Sure, um, uh, opposed athletics? Yeah. <laughs> Bane. Terrible for me. 
Thank you. There's a bane. Uh, she rolled bad, so you might be okay. Uh, athletics. She's also more dexterous than she is yeah. strong. Uh, 13. So. Uh, you succeed. Because she is more dexterous than she is strong, and so, uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, you, okay, she yeah. is grappled. Hey, oh, uh, hey, how you doing? Uh, hug I, it out, let's I, hug it out. Let's, I, hug, let's hug it out. Uh, we can. I, I'm certainly willing to talk. Normally, I ask people <laughs> to buy me dinner first, but like this is fine, I guess. I'll buy you dinner. <laughs> I was a lot more interested in that before you stabbed me, but you know we could still chat about you did it. Best, baby. Um, I mean, I'm just saying, maybe stabbing is my love language. Um, uh, it is her <laughs> turn next, so she's gonna try to break out of the grapple. Actually, hang on, grapple. Yeah, I think you can still. I attack. think I can still stab you, right? Yeah. <laughs> no. Let me double check this real quick. Grappled. Uh, speed zero, no bonus speed. Effects. Um. Oh yeah, no, she's just gonna be like, yeah. I mean, like, look, we can still talk about that. If you guys are willing to just return the painting and maybe uh, let me have a couple free swings at your friend there, we can just go out for pizza. I hear there's a great uh, gluten-free, uh, carb-free option down at the down at the new bar. As she just takes one of her short swords and just like shunk backwards at uh, Stewart. Uh, what is your AC? Oh my god, you 14. guys are so crunchy. I'm so yeah. sorry, everybody. Um, that will miss because I keep rolling fours on this goddamn Bane. <laughs> Woo! Um, Who Baned? You Baned? I Baned. Thank you for Baning. You're welcome. Look, Ocean's might be upbeat, but Ocean also Ocean's is killing it. MVP. <laughs> Getting shit done. Okay, I told the bad guy where we were going. You baned them. <laughs> Worst VP, MVP. I think that's just teamwork. Yeah, yeah that's, that's 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 why you can't do a high school boat. A Velcro you have startled to have, me. I'm sorry. You I have was to have a like, team. Why I was trying happen? to find a measure. Well, why? A measure. Because we're about to get done. Because uh, Herbert's now in the middle of us, and he's gonna Google plus all of us. <laughs> Um, you know, oh. you check. Did, that was, yeah. Huh? Did anyone go after me? Yet? Uh, dusk. dusk is mid-turn. Dusk, okay. ju or just, okay. Dusk just oh, completed yeah, yeah, yeah. her. She yeah. yeah. Actually, you. she gets two attacks. No, absolutely she doesn't. Missable. She tries to, like, do the very cool, like, double up her short swords and go behind, and just, like, fully, fully to the sides. <laughs> Cannot aim it. It's like, you are... Much slimmer than I realized. That coach <laughs> is really deceptive. Holy crap! <laughs> like I was, wow. That gives you a lot of extra bulk. It must be the shoulders. Fascinating. Maybe I should get one of those. Um, uh, it is now Herbert's turn. Um, Herbert uses his turn to add us on Google Plus. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously, uh, Herbert uh, looks over at um, this like weird grunting thing that has been chilling over here, very casually behind Priscilla, and just looks and is like, "Look, I mean, I also could add you." And like, sorry, man, I just got to say, like, here's the thing: you cannot be servant of two masters, and the other job pays me better. So, um, uh, sorry, everybody, and I'm gonna need. What? Dexterity for us <laughs> walks over here, sorry. Um, from everybody in that ring. Uh, does that include me? Yes. I'm right on the edge of he's it. He's gonna yeah, move. Okay. All right, he's gonna, it, he's, it's it is, deliberately- It is centered on him and it is going it is, to hit. I it. knew it was suspicious. He was just walking towards us. I, well, I have yeah. very short legs. I'm very far uh, away, everybody. It took me a minute to become interesting. What is, what is this? Okay. He is, now I really like? want to kill him. What does it look like? So here's what it looks like. He walks up. Can I up. use bits on his AP throw? Uh, uh, yeah. yeah. Okay. I'd be down. Get, get, get your numbers, hold them, and let me paint you a word picture. A, a word. You add a d6 to the roll. Um. So they take your roll, number and then roll a d6 roll, and then yeah, add the number. And Math! Then you, so this the singular plus it, so when I roll the d20 <laughs> plus so when I roll the d6 plus two. Right. Okay. Yeah. So this dwarf I walks up. I like that roll. Explain, yeah. like, just doing this whole thing of just like, I'm sorry, I cannot. I'll wait, I'll wait, it's fine. 
I thought that's what I no, we used the bit. It's the same twenty. The You're just adding ah, okay, into six okay. on. So okay, so we it's pretend. original roll. The, there we go. I know how to do things. Plus your stupid. Okay, so are we good? Are we yeah. good? Yeah, we're good. Hi. Great. Continue, Paint us please. a picture. Please. Walks please. up, takes this robe he's been wearing, throws it off. You see now that this little frost dwarf is covered in tattoos. Face, arms, chest, back. Uh, and he just looks and is like, uh, so, you know, I mean, this really sucks. Cannot serve two masters. Other job pays me better. Hey, um, for whoever it applies to, because I didn't get full instructions, Prisoner 13 says hello. Yes? Um, and you see the tattoo on his back like roils up with light and fire and erupts as though he is the center of a fireball. Awesome. So uh, yeah, so we had dexterity saying there's, I need to make one real quick for my guy who is just gonna be caught up in this, unfortunately. Um, might be actually great for you guys cause he did not roll great on his save. Um, what'd you get? Uh, 18. Uh, 10. 10? 10, 10? Was that your answer? Just the look? I'm in a tree. Sorry, I, no, this was me. I'm <laughs> yeah, just like, yeah. your like, look was there. You're looking at me. Um, our uh, grunty friend did not fare well. Priscilla, thankfully, despite her disadvantage, has insanely high dex um, and just barely passed. <laughs> so. Everybody who got above a 15, which is going to be Tyr and Priscilla, is going to take seven fire damage. Um, Ocean and our buddy are going to take 14 and are knocked prone. Okay. Um. Yep, Blade Ward did not help me a damn bit with nope. that. Uh, how much did you say? 14. Gross. Could have been a lot worse. Not gonna lie. That was a lot all in one go. <laughs> um, I hate this guy. This guy also appears to be maybe just the tiniest bit on fire now. <laughs> just, just like a little bit on fire though. Um, cool, that is Herbert's turn. Uh, and that's gonna bring us to Ocean. Okay. Um, I would like to get off the ground. You can spend half your movement to stand up. Yes, I would like to do that. Um, and... I had a plan, I but then I, uh, that's good to know. but then I got hit and I didn't, don't like that. Um, we don't plan here. This is I know, Dungeons and, still, and Dragons. I, I, it's silly me thinking I could look ahead yeah. to my assorted spells. That's one right. turn me in advance. happy to not be a spellcaster. Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. uh, while you look at those, I will say uh, this was another thing that was voted on by our patrons because I allowed them to participate since this is a fully homebrewed off module mm -hmm. vibe. Um, so this is another thing I asked them to vote on who Dusk would bring along. Okay. Um, and it was a tie between uh, a character from the module that you guys did not encounter at the Thieves Guild and a character, the way I phrased it was, a character who is associated or, you know, an unexpected ally associated to a previous module. Um, so as I was looking for unused stat blocks or fun ideas, I was like, this seems like the obvious choice okay. because everyone felt shifty about that module and how it went down. So um, meet Herbert, who was also named. Uh, there came from the list of NPC name proposals. Excellent. Um, so having thought it over, I am going to cast Bane on Herbert as well. Okay. And then as a bonus action, I'm going to do a telekinetic shove. Um, which I think if you, can't, oh, you can't, can, you'll have to use that if you want to contact Oh, to yeah, me. I think that's worth it. Okay. What does it do? Uh, I had a card that allowed me to do two. Uh, so rather two than one. move Bane, gonna yeah. double Bane. Get a double Bane. Uh, since it seemed to be very effective. Um, and as I was saying, I am going to... 916. Huh? Thomas standing oh. up count. Oh, okay. 
Uh, I am also going to use um, as a bonus action to try to telekinetically shove um, Herbert uh, mm -hmm. up to. Uh, let's see. I somebody within thirty feet of me. Um, it'll shove him like ten feet. Five, back, uh, it back. looks like five feet back, kind of okay. that way. Um, but you have to do a strength saving throw. Um, That's fine. Yeah. You should roll a concentration check from damage. That yes, you should. Uh, okay. That so talk me through that. Con saving throw. Okay, con saving throw. Eight. So then Bane would have dropped. Correct. Would have dropped Which on. Which means the, the, first... the card didn't need to get used. Yes. So I will take it back then. Thank well, you. let me see if I can find it because I shuffled it back in. <laughs> <laughs> You okay, so one. it's it, Bane has dropped off of Correct. Dusk, but is still on Herbert. Okay. Yeah, you can. So you you can. It. Yeah, you have recast right, so it. So I effectively recast it. it. Herbert. Bane was really good on Dusk, though. Well, then maybe on my next turn I will try it again. We might have. A Wait, card. didn't you? Didn't you take Bane from me? No, well, yeah, I have it. Yeah. Yeah, you have. As you the have ability it, so to like, cast it. But... Yeah, you have the ability. So that is an option. I'm not the only person who can use Bane around here <laughs> for what <laughs> it's worth. <laughs> <laughs> For what it's He's too busy hugging right now. Yeah. But I'm not gonna make it. Just kiss. Yeah. Just, I, no, I, they're not kissing. They're just, just kissing. Just, no. Anyway, they just kissing. Stuart's making very bad kiss decisions. attack. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. You're I, doing fine. Thank Thomas you. is making very bad decisions on behalf of Stuart. Okay. Okay. You're really fun. This side of the table's fun. <laughs> that side of the okay. table's fun. Anything else? All sides of the table. We have fun. fun. Yeah. Anything else? Um, okay. Well, so it, did he? He passed the. I'm. Check. I am maintaining everything else. Uh, yes, he did. Okay. So then. Um, so yeah. So like, I accomplished almost nothing. I cool. love it when that Last happens. Two. That's great, great for Last me, two. Gemma. How are you gonna ruin my day? <laughs> I need to see how close I am. <laughs> great. Uh, I would like uh, Herbert to. Fail a wisdom save. He is less good at wisdom, so that's something. Mm -hmm. God, your stats are so good. Uh, 12. 12 does not pass. Uh, so I'm going to ask... Uh, <laughs> this is another stop fighting moment for everyone. Uh, yeah, and just start talking to him like, it's fine. You don't need to hurt anyone. You don't need to fight here today. Of the dwarf. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What's what's the like one to two word like? Is it just stop it's fighting? The stop fighting. Okay. Yeah. Same, same as last time. Yeah. Okay. We're uh, a one trick pony in this corner. You what? know, and then, if the trick works every time. <laughs> and then after this, noting this now, uh, player remember to read her player sheet and has an amendment to a previous uh office. is there anything else that you want to do um and then we'll go back no and i'm just gonna gently talk to him yeah he turns around and <laughs> will immediately engage in yeah, yeah, yeah. whatever banal chatter you would like to distract him with uh, what do we need to amend? Yes, so if I'm casting Bane at second level or higher, I can target one additional creature for each slot level above first. Okay. So I want to um, try and reinstate it against her if possible. Uh, what's the range? The range is uh, 30 feet. So I'm out of 30 feet, but I only used half of my... Is it possible for me to get close enough to kind of catch them both with my remaining move? With my remaining movement. Yes. Yeah. But you'll have to be out in the open. Okay. I'll I'll take that risk. Okay. Calculated risk to uh, impede them both. Okay. And does that just land, or do I save on that? Um, uh, I've so lost the plot on this. Yeah. Fight. Um, <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. You guys uh, actually never got the plot of why this fight is happening yeah, in the okay. first place. It's um, fine. Oops. We Wait. forgot to um, ask. It's Charisma saving throw is actually for both of them for the bane. Great. He already rolled, so I'm just gonna okay. roll for for her. He rolled the charisma saving throw, not just the strength for the. Yeah. Oh God. Throw. I yes. I yes. Because we did that, and then we went back, and now we're going yeah, for sorry. I definitely I, I rolled am, for that. I'm making it terrible. It's fine. It's fine. This is how we learn. Um, 
Uh, she passes. Okay, so... Um, so she is not baned. Okay, she's not baned. It was worth a try. It was worth a try. Okay. okay. You're good. You're good. Mm -hmm. You're just chatting with Herbert. Yeah, we're just hanging out. We're having a nice time in the snow. Yeah, a super casual, nice time in the snow. Um, 15 feet of stand up. Um, this thing, I do not have a mini to represent this, so you're just going to have to roll with me on it. This uh, creature suddenly gets large. Um... Whoa. Like suddenly, <clears throat> just like, <clears throat> um, and uh, is going to make two attacks on Priscilla. With what are you going to use? I think you're going to use your glaive. It seems like it does such better damage. Math, math, math. He is going to hit both times. So much better. Cool, 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 cool. Yeah, um, he just like, foom, foom, like two ends it right into her back uh, and uh, does an extreme amount of damage to her. Hooray! He just turns to you because you're the nearest person and just goes, hmm. He's now like towering over you because he's like eight feet tall now. Um, this thing, whatever it is, like this is some sort of monster. You don't know what specifically, it's not anything you've ever seen before, but he seems pretty chill. Like he has a job and he is here to do his job. Uh, great, that's his turn. That's gonna bring us to Tyr. Great. Awesome. Uh, Tyr's just gonna like, <clears throat> and then I'm just gonna like walk so slowly. I wanna walk 10 feet away from him this way. Just like walking. Are you going to disengage? No. Then he is going to take a swing on you. This was actually my plan. Uh, what is your AC? 15 right now. 15 right now. Uh, and he got 16, so that will hit. It's gonna be 15 slashing damage. Uncanny dodge, please. Okay, that's gonna be seven slashing damage. <laughs> okay, I'd like to say, I'd like to like turn around and rush back at him and attack. And I'd like to tell Priscilla, you can leave now. Mechanically, he's used his reaction. Priscilla, go. Um, and I'd like to attack with my I will keep that in mind when it is actually my turn. Thank you. <laughs> I'm um. helping. Okay, rapier attack, please. Mm -hmm. That is my damage dice. That's the wrong one. I mean, you can roll that eight if you want. <laughs> it seemed to be doing better. <laughs> uh, 23. 23. That will hit. Mm -hmm. This fell victim to my three curse, so we'll see if that... I also just noticed uh, something fun else about this guy's stat block that I hadn't noticed before. That's good to know. Dislike. Uh, four plus it's two great. is six plus sneak attack. Nine, 14, 15, 16 points up. Damn it, please. Oh, cool. Uh, yeah, you stab into him and he just kind of like looks, looks at you. Dislike, dislike. Um, and that's my turn. Okay. But I used his reaction. Pretty proud of that. Um, that's going to be Priscilla's turn. She's going to uh, recognize that this uh, is not super great. She's going to Misty step back up here. Um, and I think she's going to take two pot shots at. You're distracted. You're engaged. Ah, she's gonna take a couple pot shots at dusk. Oh, so close, babe. Would have loved to use that natural 20, but you are super disadvantaged. Three levels of exhaustion! Um, she's gonna hit with one. I roll damage for her. Die. Mm -hmm. 
Uh-huh. You're hot too. Oh, no, I just... Cool. Um, <laughs> we're physically dying. <laughs> she sinks <coughs> a shot into dusk. <laughs> sure. Ooh, you nice. just, yeah, you're just like, she like slides right past and you're just like, oh, hi. Sorry. No, no, good job. Um, uh, Dusk, this was a really stupid thing that I did. So, uh, I'll see ya. I'm gonna misty step <laughs> next to the monster out of my spell store and ring. Thank you for that. Excellent. Where you wanna be? Over. 30 feet puts me between the dwarf and Tyr. That's ocean. Oh. Oh, wait, no, that's Tyr. I'm yes. the green one. Uh, next one over. The other way. I'm the cute green yes. one with a fireball. So then I can attack I can them, the big monster with my rapier. Cool. It's your charisma. <laughs> 23 two hits? Uh, yes. And it is 10, 12, plus 3. 15 points of damage. Way here. Way here. That's a decent amount of damage. Um. Pick on someone smaller than you. I think it's so funny that Dusk was so like hurt, and we're all like, "Oh shit, other problems." Yeah, right. We're fine. Dusk. It took Herbert a long time to get in an appropriate <laughs> fireball range. I'm just saying, it was always his his instructions, but he had to get to where it was like worth it. We should have um. taken him out before he got to us. We we knew it was suspicious. Yeah, he was unthreatening. Yeah. He was just walking. Stuart's a man of character. Man of... Cool. He's a character. <clears throat> man of cop character. Right now he's pimping, I'm just saying. <laughs> man of pimp character, that's true. That's true. Um, cool, okay, that's Dusk's turn. Uh, she's real grumpy about this situation. What? Ocean, you are the nearest. High or low? <gasps> Low. He attacks your ankles. <laughs> um, she is going to just kind of screech in frustration, uh, and uh, so uh, now she's gonna run up and take because then she can take two short sword attacks at Aww. you. But why? Because you're the closest. I'm just a little guy. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, first one misses, but the second one is going to hit. Okay. Um, and I need a constitution saving throw. You're gonna actually need two of them. One for the poison and one for your spell. That doesn't sound very good. No, it doesn't. But at least it gives you two chances to fail. Or succeed. Or succeed. Okay. Look, I have to go with the optimism of maybe so I'll find the first one somebody. is an eight. <laughs> And the second one is a 16. Uh, where, where am I? Yeah. You're gonna fix everything. Okay. Uh, this is good. Um, can I react with silvery barbs? Ooh. I, I'm taking that as a yes. If you haven't used your reaction yet this turn, which you haven't, then yeah. yes, you can force a reroll. There is the possibility that she r rolls better and it still hits. So as long as you're willing to burn it. You so, haven't really been using your reaction, so I feel like it's fine. Yeah, let's try it. Oh my god, what if it was an act? <laughs> it was not, but... Is this lower or the new roll? If silvery barbs, do you take the new roll or you take the, the new roll. roll? Yeah, got it, got it. Yeah, it just forces use the a lower. Roll. Use the lower. Use the roll. lower roll. Great, it. it's lower by one point and it still hits. Okay, cool. Uh, so what? So, uh, what were those constitution saves? Uh, it was eight and sixteen. I'm going to let you choose. Do you want to take the poison damage or do you want to lose concentration? What am I even using concentration on bane, right now? Bane. Mm. Did either of those Banes actually take? Because I know the one on her bane, did not take. But Herbert has Bane. However, if anyone attacks Herbert, then uh, it will... Ju right now, Gemma is fully controlling Herbert okay. to not fight. I feel like you can drop So bane. if you yeah. attack him, he will like go back into combat. I feel like losing concentration is probably the right. better of the options, especially since my hit points are getting a little low. I That seems like a good idea. Yep. <laughs> okay. But I'm going to give you the choice always. Thank you. Okay. 
Uh, yeah, the poison doesn't take, it's just real spicy for a second, but you manage to kind of push it off, um, but you do kind of slip your concentration. That's okay, he's very focused on uh, being like, no, but here is the thing, right? Pulp is not bad thing. Pulp just refers to quality of pages upon which it's printed. Better for mass market. If you are taking things to widespread market, then you print on pulp. Everyone acts like has to be low literature. Can be better literature than We haven't than even gotten a publisher yet. So we're not even at the paper stage. Yeah. What uh, book? This entire conversation has been going on in the background of <laughs> oh. everything. What else? Uh, also, um, I could then choose a different creature I see within range uh, mm -hmm. who has advantage on the next attack roll. Who you want to give it to? Ooh, let's see. Who seems to need it the most? I will say that uh, Gemma is probably not going to attack. In this okay. Oh, I don't have to. I can attack. Oh, you I can? can? Okay. Him. I mean, you can. Uh, Tyr will probably make an attack, and yeah, if you give I'm it gonna... to Priscilla, then it just negates her disadvantage. So... I'm, I'm going to give it to Tyr for fun. Okay. For fun. I think I did lose my sneak attack because I... Yeah. Okay, because so yeah, I'll give, you, uh, I'll give you advantage mm. on your next attack roll. Or the ability check so or saving fancy. throw. Cool. Uh, all right, you have the advantage. Wait, I don't need it. Oh shit! I'm sorry. That's that's a me not knowing my own class thing. It's fine. I'll take it. Thank you. Okay. You might have to take a saving throw before then. That's not likely, but possible. That's true. Um, Gemma, that is your turn. What would you like? Thank to do? you. You're um, welcome. Yeah, we're just there talking is about an NPC books, in and I'm just gonna like casually toss an Eldritch Blast this direction. Great. Uh, <laughs> no, but what I'm saying is we're still working on it. <laughs> no, yeah, we're still working on it. We haven't. Sp and it was two good possibilities. Uh, that's a 19 to hit. Oh, yeah. Um, right for the belly button ring. Uh, which is going to be uh, 13, 16 points of damage. Thus goes down. <gasps> yeah, yes. and so, so, but if you have good recommendations for... <laughs> I am just saying, I know like, plenty of publishers. Uh -huh. Where are you looking to publish? I, are you willing to... Where do you want to cut costs is really question, right? Oh, yeah. Like, you have to understand, is it quantity or is it quality? Because something is always going to suffer, but suffering does not mean bad. Um, that's going to be um, our big guy's turn. Uh, he uh, is going to uh, assess, assess the situation and just uh, look at you, Tyr, and just and disappears. No, I want an attack of opportunity. Where'd he go? Can I see where he went? Did he just like go ten feet? And I'm like, oh, he you're right shimmered there. and vanished from Damn your it. sight. Damn it! Hush. I wanted to hit him. Uh, it's your turn. Can I hit him? It means he's gonna hit back. Potentially. I want to do it. I wanna hit the guy! Uh, Herbert. I wanna move to Herbert. Okay. Um, and I don't need to flank him. And I We don't use flanking in this that. game anyway. Great. At least not in this in Golden Vault, we do not use flanking. Understood. <laughs> Other DMs could do what they if want. If I don't hit, he's still a puppet. puppet. Oh my god. Uh, I think it's. And what number would that be? Uh, uh, I keep rolling a three. Oh, okay. So that's a eight. So that is not going to hit him. So I'm just like, like, like the. Like, oh, I was, was that just with, was that with flexing. Advantage? Was that with advantage? Did I get advantage? Yeah, she yeah, gave you advantage. You a bitch, okay. You don't have to use the advantage if you would like to choose to not I would hit like to and really just... fucking use the advantage. Okay. We still have a half hour that I can get I'd away like with running to, this fight, uh, but you're gonna have to go faster. I'd like I'm to sorry. Hit like, okay. Make some choices. Okay, okay, 21, 21. 21, great, you hit him. Okay, Speed okay. Run. Okay, that's a one. Plus two is three. Uh nine. Ten. 14, please, of damage. 14. Uh, you uh, get him. Oh, this person's off the deck. Oh, oh, he had the most hit points left. That's fun for me. Um, cool. That's my turn. Yeah, you stab him, and he and he suddenly stops. The question is just like, this is trick. This is wizard trick. You are doing shitty magic to me, are you not? I am definitely a wizard. You got me. Good. Yeah. Wizard's easier to hit. Yeah. 
Um, that is. Oh. You got me. <laughs> you got me. God damn, this is being really difficult. I might. I was very interested in our book conversation, though. Well, because I'm a wizard. Well, maybe you should think about that before you have friends stab me in back, huh? Um, it's true. We're just coworkers. Yeah. Uh, this I just met her yesterday. <laughs> We're not that close. This is. I consider us. You know what? I'll take that, Stuart. Thank God. I, I was talking to Gemma, but that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> He's just an acquaintance. <laughs> I'm no longer a- associated with the cop voyeur. Don't forget, also a pimp. Cop pimp voyeur. The cop. Um, and Pris- kissing friend. <laughs> Priscilla uh, knocks one arrow, fires it, misses Herbert, just like takes a moment, kind of does the like shake it out, fires boom, boom, straight into like the <gasps> head. Um, because she finally rolled like a reasonably good combination of things, even with all of her disadvantage. Um, uh, he takes a significant amount of damage from that. He's still looking very healthy. He's just more injured now than he was. With an arrow in his head. I mean, he's got several arrows just kind of sticking in him. He just like, they're just there. They just seem to be part of the uh, acute run out. That is Stuart. I'm going to uh, move. To dusk. Mm-hmm. You're gonna take an opportunity attack unless you disengage. That's fine. Okay. Just always double checking. Uh yep, that's gonna hit. Okay. How much repeat once he's done attacking me? Double check. Oh, tribute. Two oh, tricks. he's got an amazing amount of range. That's good to know. Okay. I believe, and he's large. Uh, no. Uh, he's uh. He's regular. Uh, he is no. This guy is regular, oh. but you see every time uh, as he swings at you with his weapon, uh, light from his tattoos shoots into the weapon and extends past it and gives mm. it range. Damn. Yeah. That's cool. Because uh, he's just wielding like a normal ass short sword. Um, uh, so that's gonna be 12 damage. Oof, okay. And I don't know what Hellish Rebuke does. Uh, 4d10. It's a dex save. Ooh. Is that from your pearl? Ring, yeah. Ring? It's 4d10, 4d10, 4D, 4D fire 4D10. damage. Oh my god. Uh, okay. So, math again. So 11, 20, 28 points of damage. Okay. And I get to dex save on mm-hmm. that? Uh, his dex, I don't think his dex is that great. I don't know if it's yours or mine. Though. I use the spell okay. casters, so what's yours? Okay. 14. Uh, he's gonna take all of it. What was that number again? 28? 28. Yikes. That's a good spell. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, I just, <laughs> you just, I just like, realized oh, yeah. something, too. Uh, no, yes. okay. I had to double check. I was like, is he vulnerable to fire damage? Because he's, he's a cold guy. Dwarf? He is not, but I'm glad I checked. Because he's got immunity to... Uh, oh! Hell Shrubuk's a reaction, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay, perfect. I fucked up something extremely drastically <gasps> in this fight. <gasps> I'm not going to redact it. Don't lean into my camera shot. Sorry, I'm sorry. I'm to sorry. the audience. I'm sorry. <laughs> um, but I'm calling it out so I remember to talk about it in the after dark. Um, I'm not the DM. We're proceeding forward now. You know, t- show me a DM who actually reads stat blocks. Me. Okay, I don't. Pretty constantly, <laughs> actually. Until we're in the middle of battle, I'm like, oh. Yeah, I started doing it because I kept having that where I was like, oh, that fight would have been so much better if I was using all the things. I I have been specifically nerfing Priscilla because Priscilla would wipe the floor with this entire fight single-handedly if she could use all of her things. But she can't because that's part of the setup here. Um, Anyway, great. Builds Uh, character for us. But he is going to take a whole bunch of that damage and looks very upset about it. And then I'm going to use my action to pull some rope out and start tying Dusk up. 
Okay, I don't think she was non-lethally hit. She might be dead. Oh, then I'll use Oh, no, the I just shot her. Nice. Yeah. Um, okay, then I was going to say, did you want to non-lethally Eldritch Blast? No. Okay, she's <laughs> dead. She's Unless dead. someone oh, told okay. me differently. Well, I'm... Yeah. Not death saves, dead. Uh, I don't usually roll death saves for bad guys, but uh, I can if you'd like. Uh-huh. So <laughs> It was just a question. Then I'll use my action to uh, rifle through for any magic items. Um, you find another syringe with a funky looking liquid in it in her pocket uh, and she's got uh, two poison short swords and a crossbow with some poison bolts. Okay. If any of that interests you. Tears like, she was so hot. <laughs> I didn't even get to kiss her. It's not really that worth it. Uh, oh, oh. Questions for later. Um, right, down for the talk back. God, I that was your turn. Yep. That was Herbert's reaction. That was Stuart's reaction. Uh, Herbert's grumpy. He's going to... I mean, yeah, he's going to pull out his crossbow and he's going to try to shoot Gemma now that he knows that you were messing with that. shitty wizard. <laughs> shitty wizard. You are a shitty wizard. Shitty. Weirdly, so you are a terrible wizard. Such a bad wizard. Uh, <laughs> I'm, I'm uh, 18 to hit. That hits Hellish Rebuke. <laughs> Good <laughs> lord. Okay. I feel like you wanted him to hit you. I did. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of a cool thing. Um, he fails his deck save. Okay. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay. Uh, you took 12 damage from the hit. Uh, that's way. also 28. <laughs> I took 12. <laughs> okay. Did you both get 28? Yeah. Good. It's because it's, it's your spell. That's why. <laughs> <laughs> and we're acquaintances. <laughs> but we got that one corner over here. Yeah. So, you know. Jesus Christ, man. Okay. Um, he's, he's looking bad, but he does get a second attack. Okay. Pew, pew. Uh, 21 to hit. That does hit. 12 more damage. Thank you. Don't fall out of the tree. Oh no, I'm hanging onto this tree. This tree is my best friend. Oh no, I've used my reaction. <laughs> oh, feather fall? It's okay. Just uh, reach out my hand, you fall <laughs> to the ground. <laughs> yeah, you oh. smack it. Oh. oh, that's right. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Oh, that's all right. Oops, never mind. Um, okay, great. That was his turn. Ocean, it is your turn. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm out of ideas. <laughs> there is always stab. That is true. I'm not recommending it. I'm just pointing it out as an option. There is always stab. Um, so I do have a crossbow mm -hmm. uh, on my person. Can I yes. quickly nab one of those poison bolts and shoot him? We just established that there are poisoned crossbow bolts sitting uh, right next to me. Normally, I would treat it the same way as my potion rules, which is if it's something you have on your person, so you can immediately grab and go to it, that's a bonus action. But if you're giving it to somebody else or getting it from somebody else, that's a full action. Okay. So I'd say you could take your full action to grab the crossbow bolts and load them up or grab the crossbow and get it loaded up because you have to get it off of her body. Okay, but I have my own crossbow. Yes, yeah, so it's still gonna take a full action to like dig out her bolts and load. Okay, them. but if I were to use my own crossbow with my normal, bolts, you can just I shoot, shoot that him regular. I, I allow weapon swaps to just happen. Okay, cause... then I am just gonna shoot him, just a yeah, regular shooting fine. action. He is very hurt, so that Get him. might be fine. Okay, so go ahead. Uh, okay, what am I rolling? What do, how do so, I do this? Crossbow. If you go to your action. There we go. I know how to play D&D. Um, you got some, this. Somebody probably does at this table. I think um, it's Thomas. Okay. Yeah. He's okay. definitely got years on most of us. All the additions roll together at this point. Like, oh. <laughs> I'm really proud. I have not asked yeah. for a single will save so far yes. on camera. I'd so. like to okay. just take so 20. I've got five. Uh, yeah. What's so your thought, though? D20 D plus five. Yes. Okay, 15 to hit. Will miss. Oh. 15 D6. misses? No, oh, too on who? The only hostile that you can still oh, aim at. Oh, cool, 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 who cool, has, cool. Who has heavy armor? Thank you. Uh, who or actually isn't wearing any armor, but does have a glowing tattoo that lights up every time mm. you try to hit him. Who's your tattoo guy? 
Oh, have a really great, uh, <laughs> really great gal up in ten towns. You ten want town? number? That would be great. Yeah, I will leave business card on your rotting corpse. Thank you. Sure. Once per short rest, <laughs> if I fail or if I miss with an attack roll, I can roll two d four and add it to the total, possibly changing the outcome. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Sorcerer. Uh, an additional three. That will hit. Ah! Nice. Favored by the gods. Yeah. All right, do that damage. Uh, yes, I have to find where, okay. Uh, damage is 1d8 plus 2. Did you roll a 1? Did. So 3, 3 damage. Woo. Three he damage. looks so <laughs> hurt, you guys. Wait, Just he's, like, he's hanging on by a thread. So incredibly hurt. Like, you, you could almost four. blow on this guy That's and knock him over. Night. Uh, <laughs> do I have anything I can do for this bonus action? Uh, I, I can still telekinetic shove for five feet, but I don't think it's worth it. It just it seems mean at this damage. point. Uh, it, and it would just be rude at this point. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> live your life, I guess. Um, calling that it? Yeah, I think that's it. That's it. Uh, Gemma. I'm gonna move my hex. Uh huh. <laughs> oh yeah, that thing. Uh oh gosh, I don't think that's gonna hit. God, so many. It's not. Doesn't hit. But he's hexed. Did you wanna spend a bit on it before you declare? We. Do we have one? Yeah. Yeah. We're not gonna use it. Nope. Do it. Oh, Look nice. at all that catching. I'm just saying, now's the time to just burn him. Uh, yep. I think that's a 17. 17 is exactly what you need to hit. <gasps> oh, I'm writing that down so I know for future reference. Yeah, if you ever fight <laughs> this specific dude you're about <laughs> to murder again, again, if you decide to resurrect uh, him. It's going to be 13 damage. Uh, yes, he uh, did not have many hit points left. You absolutely just... I'll take the business card off of your corpse. Okay, left puck. <laughs> <laughs> Boom. Uh, you are now out of combat. Um, Yay. Gonna... I didn't even get to kiss her. <laughs> hey, Priscilla. Priscilla. Gonna... Could you tell us about that painting now, please? Priscilla, what the fuck? I know you've been dying to tell us about I the painting. Know. Honestly, so we keep ignoring your opportunities uh, to tell us more. Honestly, at this point, I don't know if it's really worth it. I mean, Oh, but I'm so curious. Were... <sighs> Why were they so mad at us? Why were they after us? What? It's a painting. To what end? Why did all this happen to us today? Can you come down from that tower? Uh, hang on. Let me see how many spell slots I can. I got Whoop. you if you just jump. Uh, she misty steps back oh, down. Okay. I was like, okay, great. Um, well, we know that one works. That's always a good sign. Um, pretty consistent with that one most of the time. Great. Um, uh, right. So, uh, this is very complicated. Where did you want me to start? Um, the. I'd like to start. You did you. You said that you've kissed her, is that true? <laughs> How was it, if so? Mediocre at best. Scale I'm not sure ten. why that's where we're starting. I'll write that down, thank she you. She is dead, so I don't know A that... scale of 1 to 20, how would you rate? I mean, like... I, I wasn't really busy rating it, I was sort of trying well, but to... we have time now. I was... What, I know, but what I'm saying was that I was doing other... Th I was kissing her to distract her while oh, uh, well, somebody cool. else was taking things out of the room. It you wasn't know, really, like... Been there. Yeah. All right, let's oh, she jump not forward. Been there, but she wants to. <laughs> yeah, I, no, Chris is like, I feel like of any group of people I could say that to, you all probably understand what I'm... Uh, of course. ...getting at. We've all been there. Um, right, yes. So, um... The painting, as I think I briefly alluded to, used to belong to my father. Yeah. Or at least it was in his possession for a time. And uh, Guildmaster Dusk, which was not the name I knew her by at the time, um, seemed... What name did you know her by at the time? Lydia Tiger. Ooh! Uh, which I'm fairly certain is not her name, given that she's a, only a half-elf, and in order for my father to also be her father, re the math really does not work out, because I know where he was for those two centuries. Um, and it was not anywhere where he would have been, you know, creating more siblings for me. Um, but she had the balls and the know-how to use our family name to get access to the location of the painting. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, seemed to maybe know what it was. Um, and, uh, 
So, of course, I may have, in the course of my duties, um, you know, gotten some dirt on her and turned it into the authorities, which really kind of reset her entire criminal empire, and she had to rebuild it from the ground up, so she doesn't care for me that much. Didn't. Didn't. Correct. Looks like I'm not going to be dealing with her again, although I am probably going to have to go buy off the rest of her employees. They might Oops. work for you. I do not want any of them working for me, to be quite frank. Oh, okay. uh, one of them got himself pickpocketed in a bar, it sounds like, <laughs> because he was distracted talking to the barmaid. Uh, one of them is just a scary motherfucker and I don't want him anywhere near me. And uh, the third guy we never even saw. So, um... All right. Well, I, great it was just lot a of use he was. Hmm. I I don't know. It was just a suggestion. I mean, technically, I'm not in charge of hiring anyway. I'm on payroll for my father. Hmm. And the Golden Vault. So I'm a little, you know, occupied. Fair. So the painting is uh, a oh yes, a the spy painting. Device. Yes. Uh. Yes. It was. Um. Uh, apparently, uh, this was a very common uh, creation and gift of uh, Diane Gristhorn. She was a great patron of the arts. Um, uh, you uh, know of her, Ocean, the uh, great criminal mastermind. Oh, yeah, of course. Uh, yes. Yeah. Um, she used to commission all kinds of these magical paintings um, with this uh, particular property to be able to just listen to everything going on around them. Uh, frequently used to gift them to people, uh, only some of whom did she tell what it was doing, depending on if she was trying to, you know, help them out or help herself. Respect. As it were. Um, my father very much knew what it was because you can't really pull one over on somebody who's been in his line of work as long as he has been. Um, so he planted it here in the material plane because at a certain point um, you only have a finite number of children who can go running around through the planes to check on things for you and only one of them can be in multiple places at the same time. So... Uh, Which one? Not me. Which one? The, did I not tell you about my brother, the Time Wizard, earlier, Scipio? Oh, okay, with Scipio. Oh, is okay. it Time Wizard? Did I, I'm sorry. Did I not I feel make like you that, that clear? I'm just I, clarification question. Did Dewani then commission them from the painter? Um, uh, uh, Diane commissioned them from Dekesi Kwan and a couple of other very um, well-known. Um, painters who had the ability to imbue these paintings with magic. So what does the painting know you didn't want to get out? All kinds of information. Oh, just give us a taste. What was the catalyst? I don't know. I'm not attuned to it. Mm. I don't have access to the information unless I attune to it. I feel like you were worried about something in particular. Yes. I'm so... Have we all not figured out yet that my father is the Grand Spymaster of the Seely Court? Well, he I literally yeah, has we, tabs on everyone. Yeah, we all we all figured that out. And it yeah. doesn't work. We Yeah, we, we, we all know that. what Sealy Court is. We knew that. We we all figured Do that out. Do you? <laughs> yeah, I mean it's it's just like this one, but um warmer. Yeah, exactly. Yep, been there. It only works for you to be a spy master if you have more information than the other spy masters. Okay, fair. I thought there might be something else. Mm. But I mean, never mind. something juicier. I mean, there's pro it probably does plenty of juicy things, but again, I don't have access to any of that. Can can you attune to it so we can know the juicy stuff? Why on earth would I tell you something that might incriminate my family? Oh, so we can blackmail you later. For? No, 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 like a bonus because we did such a good job. Like a tip. Yeah. Because we did a really good job of stealing she the painting for you. She bedazzles her thongs with real jewels. Oh! You probably get like a good like 250 GP off of whatever you pluck off of whatever she's wearing under those incredibly tight pants. You know what? How's I that? Hear, would you like to do the office? I respect the diversion, but yes, I will be doing that. <laughs> that wasn't a diversion, you wanted something juicy, so I gave you something <laughs> juicy. Jewels. <laughs> I mean, I think it, in reality, we just have one big question that we want answered. Can I keep this outfit? Oh, <laughs> yes, it doesn't fit anyone in the family anymore. It looks um, better on you than it ever has on anyone. Special occasions. Absolutely. Special occasions. Absolutely. Special occasions. <laughs> this and ended in Y. <laughs> <laughs> I think your girlfriend is, is really going to be into this new look. The color is really good on you, I'm just saying. 
Who is the dude in the painting? Oh, his name's Constantinori. He was a very famous courtier, famous for being an absolute pain in the ass, but being so pretty. Okay. Should we say hi to him? Uh, he's kind of a dick in the painting version, to oh. be perfectly honest. Well, at least he always was to me. Maybe you'll, you'll fare better. Um, eh. You know, he might be a little more uh, chill now that I, I presume Dusk attuned to him, or at least was in the process of so doing. So he might be a little more chill if he's unattuned at the moment. But, um... Or he might just be even more insufferable. Hard to tell, really. The entire time I knew him, he was attuned to my father, so, you know. Perfect. I feel like we should ask more questions about this fabulous journey we've been on. Because this is very exciting. And I want to know there... everything about your the company you keep and the work that you do. Well, and I mean, are this... you hiring? Uh, I mean, the Golden Vault is always looking for new recruits. Well, I mean, would you like us to help? I'm sure they would love to have you in their service. Well, I mean, I don't know about you, but I'd love to. I'd like to learn how to work in a group a little bit better. Yeah, you know, I mean, I, um, I'm in high demand for my thievery services. No, I mean, you can freelance sure, on the side in between But I'm gigs. sure I could open. probably make myself available for future, um, future heists and other mischief. Wonderful. I'll As make my schedule sure allows. to uh, give your names to the higher ups and, uh, you know, keep you in touch. Well, I'm just thinking you should uh, definitely check in on one of those sleep studies. <laughs> yes, I yeah. think I'll be uh, like tonight. looking into that. Wasn't there a, there's a university at the, uh, uh, oh, yeah. Gargenheim, or... Uh -huh. Oh, Vargenheim, yes, the one that you all, like, live <laughs> around, where we're constantly getting interrupted by melee ball teams and rugby players every time we try to go to the bar. Oh, they're probably gonna be there when we get back. I mean, I don't know, time passes differently here, so either we'll be returning right in the middle of the final big game, or it'll have been three days ago. Or I'm not sure months. which direction we're in, unfortunately. I mean, I guess if we have a specific time that we want to return back, I could ask uh, Scipio to try to, like, focus in, but it doesn't always work. He's very, you know, skittered. Is Scipio coming? I hope so! I, again, I got no, a just message. Live here now. Um, I think so. I was really hoping that he was, but um, apparently hasn't rolled higher than a 10 this entire episode to make it here. If only he was the type of guy who could not go below a 10. You know, I'm just saying. Some, you know, some uh, choices were made. In past lives, you could take 10 and just, you know. You know, that's true. I, 16. you know, at some point he's probably going to, at that moment you just see like a, la <laughs> a flash of light from like the other side of the castle and goes, that's probably him now. Priscilla, may I, um, and again, if you don't want to answer, you don't have to, but, um, is something been bothering you lately? Is there something that's, mm-hmm. Um, I mean, there's a, there's a few things. Um, when I say that I work for my father, that is factual. And when I say that I work for the Golden Vault, that is also factual. And when I say that the important thing about being a spy master is knowing what the other spies know, Something is up. And I don't know what it is, and I don't like knowing less. And neither does my father. Which is why we let me get recruited by the Golden Vault. Does that mean you are spying on the Golden Vault? Some people might put it that way. You're a double agent? Uh, I prefer the term, uh, negotiable alliance. Like Sydney Bristow in Alias. Was that the one that was touring a couple of summers ago in the, in the... Oh, in maybe. The it was very popular, I seem to recall. <laughs> I never get much time to go to the theater. I like 
you. I don't necessarily care about this golden vault. <laughs> so, we can help you. They don't know who they are. They, they know, know who, who are. you are. It's true. Uh, I'm, now, I'm now they absolutely in, know who you are. You just absolutely counties. took down one of the most notorious thieves guilds oh. in I'm very Rotten notorious. Times. And oh, well known yes. and widely, uh, widely hunted for. I thought you wanted this off the Golden Vault radar. I did, and then, um... Well, they're not here. We were just too good at... Here's the thing. We're going to get back, and, um, Guildmaster Dusk is going to be dead, and the Agile Hand is going to be in ruins, and there's not really a better way to hide how that happened from the Golden Vault than to just tell them, oh, uh, it doesn't... They're not going to believe that these two took them down single-handedly. They know what these two can do. They would have helped, certainly, but they would have needed assistance. She doesn't think you're capable. But what if part if of If I that... didn't think he was capable, I wouldn't have brought him along. I'm trying to stir the pot and you're being so complimentary. <laughs> my charisma is shockingly high <laughs> for my class. <laughs> so what? So should we not go back to where we were? I guess it really depends. Are we on the run? Here's the thing. Are we on the run? We could be on the run. You don't have to be on the run. You could just um, agree to be on the books for the Golden Vault. You don't even have to take the jobs if you don't want to. They'll oh. come to you occasionally, see, make you an Fine. offer. You can negotiate for the higher rewards. There's nothing wrong that I know of with working for the Golden Vault. Their entire mission is to help the underdog, to do good for people who may not be able to have good done within the confines of the law. Nothing that I've found indicates that anything is wrong with them. So that's do you think, why I'm digging. Do you think you're spying needlessly? Maybe you're doing it wrong. It's entirely possible that it's going to turn out that I'm on the wrong side of this. But blood is thicker. Especially when you've only got half of it. So, bedazzled panties. <laughs> yes, no, I just, I think she hand sews them. It's so specific and it's so, there's no fabric there. What are you even sewing them to? At this point, you see rolling around <laughs> the corner, a like seven foot tall, um, like, man with this deep, deep skin and these, like, long, uh, dreads going all the way down to his back. They were kind of clamped back. And he just, like, waves at everybody. And you see he is kind of, like, walking with and half carrying this, like, just, like, absolutely bedraggled-looking, uh, uh, elf with long, like, white blonde hair, very much like Priscilla's, but much more, like, sun-kissed, tan complexion who just looks like a little bit cuckoo in the eyes. Like he's like maybe not quite fully aligned. There's a little, you know, or whatever. And and you just hear him kind of muttering like, no, but you don't understand because if you layer them on top of each other, then I could do even triple the amount. And he's like, yes, yes, Scipio, you're doing wonderfully. Hello, Priscilla, sorry it took us so long. He was in the middle of trying to um, shoot a phantasmal dragon into the astral plane, but have it appear in the hells at the same time. I'm not quite sure. He's been babbling on about it. You can ask him about it over dinner. Hello, everyone. Hi, I'm Gunther. Wonderful to meet you all. Hi, Gunther. Hi, yes. Gunther. Um, where do, uh, how would you like? Uh, do you want ritual circle? I've got more cards for you. Whatever you, uh, whatever you'd prefer. And Priscilla just walks over before he can really uh, finish. She's like, we'll just do it. We'll just do it the normal way. Skippy, oh, like, oh, wonderful dinner. Uh, waves his hands, <laughs> claps them together. Bright light surrounds you as you. You, uh, teleport. And that, of course, is where we want this. Everybody roll your con checks. 11. Six. Let's both roll a three. Stewart again. 17. Roof. 11. 17. 
I love it. Ocean, ocean. you're funny. <laughs> Teleporting is great. Ocean is great at teleporting and is looking around at all these folks who keep barfing. It's like, come on, guys. Yeah, everybody yeah. else is just like, <laughs> pull it together. And that is where we will finally close out this yeah. absolute mess of an episode. <laughs> Thank you all for joining us on this wild uh, diatribe from the, the normal as we get a little bit into uh, what happens when you are so efficient at the module that you uh, run out of content. Um, you have fun. There's a lot of other ways that I could have done this. I may talk about some of them in the After Dark. Speaking of the After Dark, uh, if you're not a patron yet and you would like to become one, the After Dark is one of the things that we try to offer our patrons um, where we talk a little bit about what we did or what we didn't do in the episode. Um, we do release them eventually to the public. So if you want to know about previous shenanigans from other episodes of Golden Fault, uh, you can go to our YouTube and look for those or just watch old episodes. For the rest of this week, we've got some other fun stuff you could check out. Tomorrow, a new episode of the Redacted Reports drops. That's the Delta Green actual play that Quests and Chaos distributes. Um, I believe tomorrow it is going to be a rooster episode, Ooh. if that's enticing to anyone. Um, on Thursday, we'll get a new episode of Inspiration Point. Uh, you can hear Tiana and Adam talking about the mental side of player stats. The episode that just dropped last week, they talked about physical, they're doing mental this week. It's going to be a fun conversation. Um, for the rest of this month, please stay tuned. We uh, are probably going to go back on hiatus with Keys from the Golden Vault because we've just got a lot of things going on. Uh, but if you are a patron, please watch the Guild Hall because I will be offering you some uh, very fun stuff in the next couple of weeks, specifically for our patrons. Um, and we will let all of you know what is coming up next as soon as we've got things covered. I will say I have heard rumors uh, the, of an absolute train wreck of a campaign coming in mid-September. So please uh, keep an eye on our Discord and on all of our socials for that. I think that covered everything. I Great. Think so. yeah. We're gonna go uh, natter on about all the ways that I screwed up that fight in the after dark for a few minutes, Yay. and we will see all of you very, very soon. Thank you for watching. Good night. Thanks all. Bye.